The PNG Pukpuks travelled as a team of 12 but lost three men due to injuries sustained over the weekend. Billy Toria returned with a potential fracture to his medial anterior ligament and Arthur Clements with a fractured finger. While this may pose as a threat to the national side for the HSBC Hong Kong Sevens next year, interim coach Douglas Geis has made a call to rest these key players. On the second day, we had major injuries to um, Billy Torea. I think he did a medial in his knee. Um, Emmanuel Guys, uh, Arthur Clement, I think he's got a fractured finger, and we had a suspension to um, Wesley Valley. So we ended up more or less playing with eight men on the second day. Over the past few tournaments, it has been a reoccurrence. So the team has finished with eight out of 12 men. He says in Sevens Rugby, this becomes a threat to the team's overall performance. We only take 12 on tour, so once the four were pretty much gone, we had to play with eight, so we only had like one reserve the second day. You see in the last couple of tournaments, we, we finished off with eight and nine men respectively, which is uh, in Sevens, you can't do that. Once you lose a guy for a day, you're sort of chasing the game or chasing the tournament, so we really need to really restructure our programs and Geist has made an impromptu request to the PNGRFU to look at restructuring their programs which will in turn allow for an in-depth player base. We don't have a what do you call a player base to depth in our player base to play at that level so I couldn't risk them on the second day so they should be fine after a few weeks. The need for a wider player base seems to be the code's biggest call at this point in time. Heading into the Hong Kong Sevens, the team cannot afford to lose players along the likes of Butler Morris, Billy Toria, Emmanuel Geis and Tissa Kautu, if there isn't a good enough player base to select from. Lorraine Genia, National MTV Sports.